morning, everybody. I am Russ. This is Chris. It is Thursday, bowling day. I'm super excited about that. Oh, I'm so excited about that. Uh, to, to, <laughs> I want to start this first topic off. There's the girl. There's the lady. There's the 24-year-old English teacher who got 10 years imprisonment. Uh, if you've been reading the news, you know she was involved in a nine-month relationship with a 13-year-old boy that got her pregnant. She did have an abortion. The family knew about it. She even moved the father in, of the son into the house to make it look like he was the boyfriend so they could carry the relationship on. And they said, the whole deal was, the judge, like shameless. <laughs> the judge went, <clears throat> you are supposed to be teaching the youth of America. And I'm going to have to say this, I think she taught me pretty well. <laughs> I think so. I had to learn on my own about 12. I had to learn. I, had to, I think she taught him pretty well. Now, of course, that's not right. You're 24. He's 13. She said she's in love. Come to find out, she was. She had some abuse back in her day, so she felt the need to be loved. Right. Okay. But at 13, and I went back and I was going, 13, that's 8th grade. 7th, 8th grade. And I went... If, and I, I looked at her, nice big boobs and, you know. Yep. I'm like, it's going to be hard. I'm going to stay at school. I'm, I'm taking detention. Yeah. I'm taking detention. Giving her detention. And I'm taking licks. No, I'm just kidding. But my, <laughs> my idea was, how do you, as a 13-year-old boy, pass it up? How do you, how do you, how do you, you, you don't, don't know how to say no. <clears throat> you don't. You know. You don't know how to say no. I don't know if I could say no at 49. That is a slippery slope. <laughs> For lack of better words. <laughs> but I was like, I was just, it, it, I was like, oh my gosh, I could not, I couldn't at 13. Why is everything different? <clears throat> Why is 17 in the state of Texas legal for that? 18 to drive and smoke, unless you study and then you can get your license at 16. 21 to drink. I, I'll just be like at 18, you can do whatever you want, or 16 or whatever. I think when it's ever you can get a job, that's what it should be. If you can, well, if some you people can, can never have sex. Yeah, that's exactly right. Or a license or a drink. If you can literally live on your own, if you can. You're adult enough to live on your own. It, for some, it might be 15. For some, it might be 42. Right. You know, that's, but it's going to be hard. You know, they have to set one rule. I get that part, but man, 13 years old, nine months, uh, okay. That's all I want to talk about right there. If he was the pursuer, the one thing, if she was the pursuer, it's another thing, which sounds like she was. She was the pursuer. <clears throat> so, Okay. I'm changing the subject completely. Okay. Tonight, in 500 theaters, there is a first of, of its kind done by Woody Harrelson called Lost in London. It was about his 1992 deal when he was a you know a bigger star. He was over in London. He got drunk. He was in a cab. He kicks the cab. He runs across the street. The police chase him. It's a whole. So he sounds like a movie. It is a movie, and he's recreating it, but he's doing it. In real time. Live. He is streaming it live. And it happens to be tonight, January the 19th. And it's going to be in, like I said, 500 theaters to fathom, like you said. Uh, but it got me to thinking. I can do five minutes live, I think. Well, we have talked about well, I this know. for how many years now? Of doing a no but not movie. But not a play. <clears throat> not a one-room play. That's the key. No, we, we, we talked about uh, doing something long. Yeah. But we talked about when that camera goes through something dark, we'll be able to cut. Exactly. They're not doing that. They're not cutting. So he's running from one camera into another camera's yeah. frame, I guess. 650 people, 320 extras, uh, a ton of crew, 24 sound technicians just by itself. But my question is, and they're going to stream it live, which, from what they said, it's more, it they will use more 
bandwidth or whatever than Wimbledon and what's the golf tournament over there? British Open. They will use more streaming data. I guess that's my word. That's crazy. Well, there's only so much you can use. I, so that got me to thinking. Oh, that's scary. I do a five-minute action scene. Mm-hmm. My dog's over there snoring. Five-minute action scene. And I'm going to stream it on Facebook Live. And we tell everybody it's going to happen on February the 1st. I'm not, we're not doing it. Just bear, bear with me. February the 1st, 11 o'clock. And the action scene starts. Can I Facebook Live? Would I be able? Would we be able to move around town here in Waco? And I'm asking you because you're going to know. This yeah, it'll just go in. If if you hit a bad spot, it just goes to that pixelated look. It's not a super clear look. Right. You know, so it, <coughs> it would be nice if you were in an area where you could pop from Wi-Fi to Wi-Fi. Uh, they have an they have an ad, a deal now on Facebook that pops up all the all the free Wi Fi where I could go. Yeah, you know, but getting from this location to this location would be the tough part. Would you guys be interested in seeing that? I, that's what I want. I want to comment. But would, you got to do that with one camera. That's what I'm saying. I have to do it with one iPhone camera. Yeah. Because the iPhone Seven, I'm I'm fine with. She not snoring like a G is snoring. She got allergies and snoring. But anyway, do would you guys be interested in seeing it? And it would be a for uh, for me. It'd have to be an action scene. I can't do just a sitting room talking heads. We can do that. That's no problem. We do that every morning. We're doing it right now. But do you think we could pull it off? Would it be something that would be totally different that people? I mean, it would be hard because we'd have to all communicate on where you're going, where I'm going to look. This thing. The it would, iPhone it has would a be focus. absolutely. It would be fun on our end. Oh it yeah. It would. It would. You know, even though it's not feeding, if there's a part that jumbles up and not feeding, I still think it's recording to yours. That that's the one thing I'm not sure to where people could watch it later. Oh, but, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I got you. I got but you. I don't think five minutes would be hard at all. I, I really don't. 10, 15, yeah. 5, no. You know what? I'm going to work. That might be something to do. Just just to, and it would have to be at lunch because everybody pretty much is at lunch at the same time to where you could watch it live. I'm going to work on that. But I just want to know, if I could pull this off, would you guys watch it? That's all. Would you guys watch it? I wouldn't because I'm probably going to be in. Well, you would be in it. Yeah. Well, let me ask you this. I think we ought to do it. We can fail. It don't, oh, it don't yeah. matter. Yeah, yeah, it ain't no problem. What day is Valentine's Day on? The 14th of February. What day is that? Anybody? <clears throat> Gee, quit snoring, man. Let's see here. Jeez, man. <clears throat> uh, it is a Tuesday. Ooh. I think you ought to do the Valentine Day, Valentine's Day Massacre because you like action to where this guy obliterates from start to finish. I, I have, let me find a location. And do it on Valentine's Day. Okay. Which would mean just a massacre, by the way. Don't, don't throw the Valentine's in there, but... We wouldn't have to. We have to keep you normal. No, I mean, dressed. but that is a that is a searchable. Oh yeah, a trending topic usually on like on that. Valentine's Day because of the mob. So that would be a good Texas mob Valentine's massacre. Okay, I'm I'm starting to I'm starting to flow with that. Uh, I'm gonna need about ten guys that can take off on Tuesday. That's what we gotta have. Okay, I, I'm going to work on that. You guys give me the thumbs up, <clears throat> thumbs down. I'm going to work on that. Tell you something else we can Woo! do to make it even more fun. Okay. <clears throat> we have internet airports at the backyard. Right. What if you ended it in the courtyard of the backyard 
And we could invite people down to sit up top and watch the last part of it. Okay. That's a big that's a good enough place to, to a big enough place to I could you, we could still be mobile and move. I so. mean because your LTE or four G will get you from start to finish. And then when you come into the backyard you'll connect and the last fight scene will have a wireless. <laughs> Okay. Might be something to think about. I I, I, mm -hmm. I totally agree with that. I like it. February the 14th. Now, we're going to try it. And I have an idea. We're going to try. I know you do too, but I have an idea. We're, we're going to try to start. And we, and we have to talk to Hope too because it's going to help. Because the one thing that we're not going to be able to control is the sound through the camera. So I'm going to have to figure yes, out how to, how, to, how to plug it in. <clears throat> if it's one guy. If it's one guy, yes, we can. Okay. We can mic him, run it into our deal, into our well, we'll talk phone. About, we'll talk about that. We'll talk about that. It's doable, folks. We'll talk about that. <clears throat> but Okay. All right. All right. The, the, okay, okay, okay. Yes or no? Yes or no? Okay. Johnny Manziel is now five to six days working out, sober, making a comeback to the NFL. He is on, from the reports I read on Yahoo, don't get me wrong, it was all on Yahoo. He had some people that were in his camp, said it's true. He is said, I'm doing a 180. Forget all this stuff. I'm getting my life together. Go. Not happening. He may even play somewhere else, but the NFL, I do not think, will give him a shot. Okay. I'm with you on that. <clears throat> He's not good enough for them to give him a shot. Tony Romo with two broke backs has a better shot of playing yeah. somewhere else. I would say Canada or Arena League probably do great. But he's I, a perfect Canadian football quarterback. Yeah, I want to just see the change of the, the, the stop partying. I went from this to this. One setback. Couple NFL teams going, we're not interested. Yeah, that sends could, him that back, could put down, you back down, probably. And give us your comments on that. Hope not. I mean, I don't want anybody to fail. No, I really don't. But uh, give give us your comments on that because that's a that's a that's a tough one, man. You got all the talent in the world and and blow it. That's hard for me to that's hard for me to swallow. Well, it, it happened right here in, in town. Oh, you yeah. know uh, the kid that was going to go to Baylor, uh, Cobb. Yeah, and went to Paris OU. Cobb. Played as a as a freshman. Yeah. Not many freshmen play at Oklahoma. Just don't happen. So he had a lot of guys. Oklahoma, Oklahoma State. Oklahoma. It won't be in Oklahoma this year, probably. Probably not. Let's a different see. Oklahoma. <laughs> It'll be Oklahoma State. <laughs> oh, I wish I had a. Mm. All right, now we're gonna get out of here. Uh, go. Watch it. Like it. Share. Friday. Friday what? Backyard. Brandon Jenkins. Brandon Jenkins. Saturday. The up and coming. Eric do Willis. not miss it. Eric Willis. Get your tickets now. Fair Eric with a K. Willis. Look him up on Facebook. He shot a video right here in town. I think our buddy. Uh, oh. Uh, uh, Zach Moore shot. Zach Moore shot. And one of our bartenders was the girl in it. So it's a really cool video, really good song. Eric with a K Willis. C K. Eric with a C K Willis. Can I Look put those up. can I put those up tomorrow? Can I rip them off YouTube tomorrow? And you think Facebook would allow it? I'll probably kick it off. Then I'm not even gonna worry about it. Go look it up. I'll just maybe put the the links in our description. I'll look yeah, I'll look up the uh, the name of the song because I forgot it. But uh and then you can put it in, the in there. Okay. And remember tomorrow Best of show. Thank you, everybody. I'm going to give a big shout out to now my guys that are really watching. We got Jason, Aaron Bird, Chance Hendricks. I mean, we are moving up in this world. Moving up. Yeah. Till tomorrow, I am Russ. This is Chris. Take that back. Until Monday. But the best of will be tomorrow. Best of tomorrow. Watch, like, share. Till Monday, I'm Russ. This is Chris. We are out of here.